Hello everybody, so I am going to start posting my journey um, on losing weight. I am 4 foot 10 and I currently, at my peak I weighed 211 pounds to 11.8. Um, it's a lot of weight for somebody um, my height to be carrying. Um, I'm very solidly built, which is a downside when you're short because... You don't really notice every five pounds that you put on until you're suddenly up a bazillion pounds and can't, you've lost control. Um, so about me, I've struggled with my weight my entire life. I started putting on weight at age 12 and by age 15, I was in a size 18, uh, pushing a 20 and um, my mom put me on Weight Watchers. And I liked it, and I lost about, overall, I think I lost about 75 pounds. I got down to a size 3 at 111 pounds. And I was happy. I was in bikini shape, um, enough to where I could pull one off anyways and look good. And um, it just didn't stay off. It stayed off for about four years and started gaining weight, started working in the fast food industry, and... Um, well, not fast food. I was working for TGI Fridays. Um, that contributed to about 10 pounds. Still kept most of it off for a while. Um, 2009, I hurt my back. And um, while I had already gained an additional 30 pounds before I hurt my back, hurting my back just tipped the bucket for me. I wasn't able to do a lot. I still suffer daily with back problems. Um... But uh, I didn't do the physical therapy all the time like I was supposed to. Um, you know, they're not, they're really not even clear on what my injury is. I've I've had multiple uh, different doctors say what they think it is because I can't see anything on an X-ray and you know, um, no broken bones or anything. Just you know, I've had some say that I'm having muscular problems. I'm having some say that I slipped a disc. Um, basically, I was moving a couch uh, while my husband was um, at drill for the Army, and uh, we were having company, and I was being impatient. So I decided to move it myself, and I was pushing it across the floor, and all of a sudden, I felt this snap in my back, and like it felt like I had a giant cramp in my back. And I, you know, I started freaking out a little bit because I could barely move, and I was like, okay, I'm going to lay down. Uh, and this will go away. I didn't. It just continued to get worse. And it got so bad that I considered calling an ambulance. And I probably should have out of all all the times of my life I should have called an ambulance. That was probably one. Um, I managed to get myself done in my car. Drove myself to the hospital. Um, and uh, went on from there. Anyways. Um, I want to lose this weight. You know, I want to be a mom one day. I'm 27 now. You know, i got to start thinking about that stuff. My husband wants to be a daddy really bad and um, while we're not ready to have kids just yet I want my body to be ready and I'd like to enjoy my body again um, so I'm gonna be doing um, a modified um, fasting diet basically during the day I'm gonna start um, at least Monday through Friday and as much on the weekends as possible um, uh, just gonna Ember. Um, that was my dog talking. Buddy, Ember, come here. That's my other dog, Lee. Lee, Lee, hey, buddy. I was like staring off in his face. That was weird. Here comes the other one. Hi, Emmy. Hi, 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 you. He likes to talk. So, um, I got a cut back. I don't know where. I don't, not much of a snacker. I eat like three meals a day. Uh, lack of activity. Gotta start giving this thing more use. We just got it like a month ago or so and uh, have used it. Um, it's definitely got me more active. I've, I've dropped down to a 7.2. So I'm down like four pounds in about three weeks. Uh, it's mainly because my husband has stopped eating fast food. Which in turn has gotten me to eat, stop eating fast food. 
So, but that's not the main contributor. It's it's everything. It's unhealthy lifestyle. Uh, we also quit smoking nine months ago. That helped pack on the pounds. It's just little things here and there have contributed to the weight. So, um, my main focus is going to be on eating clean as much as possible. Um, I'm not going to sit here and tell you I'm not going to have cookies. I'm not ever going to have breakfast or I'm not ever going to have ice cream. I'm not a huge ice cream person to begin with. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm not going to go about it that way. I'm going to try and more or less try to change it to where most of what I'm eating is healthier for me. I've got, my husband and I both like the Slim Fast uh, meal replacements. Those work out pretty good, but they don't last you very long. So i got to start coming up with some ideas for some healthy snacks that are locale. Um, we've got frozen fruit in the fridge. I've got bananas, which my husband, I love him so much because... He never eats fruit, and he has actually eaten two bananas in the last couple of days. It's huge for him. You just you have no idea. He's He's got texture issues with, with foods, and that was huge for him. And um, I love all fruits and vegetables. I even like Brussels sprouts. So, you know, the more, more of that that he's into, the better off I'm going to be, too, because, um, you know, I don't overdo the vegetables, probably, because I'm worried about what he wants to eat. So, um, you know, like, um, raw fruit smoothies are good. Um, almond milk is a big staple in our house instead of regular milk because we are both lactose intolerant. Um, since I've started doing the, the walking here and there, I am finding myself actually craving milk. I don't know what's up with that. But, um, anyways, um, I'm going to try and do a daily log of what I've eaten starting tomorrow being day one. Um, today, healthy choices that I made were, uh, I brought my lunch to work. I've been trying to do that every day. Um, and that's probably contributed to the four pounds I've lost in three weeks, but I want to kind of amp this up a little bit. I don't, I don't have, you know, two years to lose a hundred pounds. So, um, just, you know, the weather's getting warmer. This is a great opportunity and, you know, Incorporating different supplements like Arsenia Cambogia, which I'm trying right now. I've been on it for about three days. Haven't noticed anything yet other than my appetite is actually a little less um, throughout the day. For some reason at night, it hasn't really affected me a whole lot. But I do notice that I'm not eating as much. Um, water. Big, big water. I need to get better about my water. Um, today, I have a little half-gallon jug at work. And that... Excuse me. Um, that is a full serving of water in a day. So I try to at least get through that entire thing in a day. I, I look at it if I can get through one of those from the time I come into work to the time I leave, I'm doing good. And any additional fluids that I drink are even better. I got, today was the first time I filled it up all the way in months. I got all the way until about like that much from the bottom. So less than a half a cup of water um, left in there. Um, and I didn't fill it up till noon, so I did pretty good. I had to stop and go to the bathroom twice on the way home. Um, so anyways, um, join me on my journey, and I'll report my weight daily. Um, you know, um, hopefully, you know, everybody can be kind. Um, you know, uh, for those of us putting out there our real weight and everything, um, that's a big step. So I'll be... I'll be reporting my weight to you every day. I'll probably start doing these in the morning. Um, and uh, so I can, I'll weigh in tomorrow morning. Um, we'll see how that goes. So I don't know whether I want to do it in the morning or at night right now. So anyways, um, thank you for watching.